we're the Hugs Project. Uh, we're a troop support group that's been operating out of Oklahoma City for um, almost nine years. We're in our ninth year. We send care packages and cooling ties to our deployed troops. Uh, the cooling ties we've nicknamed Hugs because they wrap around the neck and they can reduce their body core temperature by seven plus degrees. If we can cool them down by that much, they don't die of heat stroke over there. So that was always our goal, to let them know they're loved and appreciated, and also to meet their needs, to send them supplies, to send them uh, anything that really they request. We have things that children, young children, four or five can do. We'll have them draw on our boxes that are being mailed to the troops, just to give them a little piece of poems. A lot of them have children, so to see a child's drawing on the box, would just warm their heart. There are no paid volunteers. There are no paid staff in the Hugs Project. Every single one of us does this out of love and respect. Wednesday, we're shipping out um, all the packages. We, our goal was originally to get 5,000, but we have not had enough volunteers to help out. Um, we can never have enough volunteers because it takes quite a while to get all this stuff done, get them packed up, and then get them shipped with addresses on them. And any given night, on a regular night during the week, we'll have maybe up to six or seven volunteers. And like today, for example, we have maybe 30 or 40. It makes a world of difference when we have this amount of manpower around because we can get stuff done a lot quicker. But um, we definitely always need as many volunteers as we can have. Wednesday, I believe it, the, at one o'clock is our ship out day when we're shipping all four or 5,000 care packages that we get down there. So we'll do it until we get as many done as we possibly can and we'll ship them out and change the lives of that many soldiers or airmen or marines or sailors. But what we're really, really going to need the most on December 12th, we're going to need a lot of volunteers to get all these care packages to the postal system. So if we could get some people to come to Crossroads Mall on December 12th, early in the morning, we could really use the extra help. We need a lot of hands-on because every hand is going to put their hand on the care package to send them out. So if you got some time on December 12th, remember to our troops overseas. They got our back. Help us out. I'm doing this to help them send stuff to the troops because I love the troops and I don't, I don't need to be paid by money if I'm getting paid by freedom and love. Somebody's Michael is still over there. I'm here to the end just like they're willing to be there till the end. I'm here for them. I've got their back.